안녕하세요. 어, 안녕하세요. 저 오늘은 뉴욕에 있는 클리오덴트에 왔습니다. 옆에 계신 분은 에디트의 이제 한국 법인장이십니다. 서원학, 서원학 이사님이십니다. 이사님. 안녕하십니까. 서원학입니다. 에디트 많이 사, 사랑해 주세요. 어, 네. <웃음> 여기 보시면 저희 뒤에 어, 이런 식으로 저희 이제 그 뉴욕에 그 타임스퀘어 바로 옆에 있는 어, 한국인 이제 운영하시는 이제 클리오덴트라는 이제 랩에 왔고요. 이제 올라가서 이제 클레오덴트의 부사장님이신 케빈 송 부사장님하고 인터뷰를 좀 해보도록 하겠습니다. 네, 안녕하세요. 오늘은 어, 저희가 좀 멀리 왔습니다. 뉴욕에 있는 클리오덴트라는 어, 큰 이제 랩 회사에 와 있는데 옆에 계신 분은 이제 클리오덴트의 부사장님이신 케빈 송 부사장님 인사하시죠. 네. 안녕하세요. 안녕하세요. 반갑습니다. <웃음> 네. 일단 케빈 송 부사장님은 이제 클리오덴트 부사장님으로 좀 오래 근무하시고 계셔서 저희 오늘은 부득이하게 제가 질문을 한국말로 하고 이제 어, 영어로 좀 답변을 해주시는 걸로 오늘은 한번 계획을 세워봤고요. 자, 첫 번째로는 클리오덴트 회사에 대해서 간략하게 소개 부탁드립니다. 네. Um, hello everyone. Uh, my name is Calvin. Um, sorry, English is a little bit more comfortable for me than I was p e a k i n g Korean. I did uh, live in the United States for the last 40 years. Um, So Creo Dent is a uh, dental laboratory in, uh, in New York City that uh, has grown on an exponential level uh, in the past 10 years. Uh, on a very recent level, we got voted as to be the five best dental labs in the US mm -hmm. uh, by the Dental Country Magazine. Um, currently, we serve about 3,000 doctors throughout the, the whole uh, United States. And we do have a, another side of the, the business, which is a, a milling center that does lab to lab outsourcing business. Nice. And out of that, we work with about 1,000 different labs in the, uh, the US for their custom abutments wow. and uh, the crown outsourcing uh, milling solutions. Okay. Oh, c l e a n t i n is c l e a n i n g only for c l i c k i n g In the US, 치과 기공 부분들도 많이 도와주고 계시는 것 같습니다. 어, 두 번째로는 이제 미국 기공 시장에 대해서 특징 및좀 어려운 어려웠던 점에 대해서 좀 설명을 해주시면. Uh, well, first and foremost, the, the most difficult part is gaining clients and, uh. um, and being a minority of uh, this country. It's always been challenging to meet with uh, the, the mainstream uh, leaders in the dental laboratory world. Um, I did have to go out there. I think throughout like 10 years of my uh, employment at Creo, I think we went to almost uh, 2,000 labs and uh, met with every industry leader in the, the dental area. Um, you know, but at the end of the day, um, you know, we have a very good quality uh, measurement system in place and we're one of the very few places that actually have all the, the FDA 510K uh, clearances for all of our parts um, that really helped us boost the business in the, the US. 아, yeah. 확실히 기공계를 선도하고 있기 때문에 뭐 어려움도 있으셨겠지만 그래서 이렇게 성공하신 것 같습니다. Mm -hmm. 어, 세 번째로는 이제 한국 기공 이제 실력에 대해서 어떻게 평가하시는지 궁금합니다. Um, I think South Korean technicians are the best 아. in the world. Uh, we, we even sponsor a couple of the technicians to come over to the, the States from South Korea. Um, you can't find ceramists uh, or the CAD CAM technicians now um, with their knowledge and skill sets and experiences anywhere in the world. I, I absolutely do believe the, 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 the Koreans have the, the best technicians coming up. 한국인이셔서 그렇게 말씀하시는 거 아니죠? No, no, no. <웃음> no, 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 no. <웃음> 그러면 이제 그네 번째로는 이제 앞으로의 기공 시장의 미래에 대해서는 어떻게 예측하시는지 궁금합니다. 
Oh, there's a, a lot of different uh, moving yeah. parts to that question. So I think the uh, the dental industry is going to be more on the other additive technology rather than on the other subtractive manufacturing. So additive manufacturing meaning uh, 3D printing. So the 3D printing is going to be on a, a huge uprise versus the other milling capacity. Um, I do see a lot of different uh, 3D uh, printing companies coming out into the, uh, the, the dental industry in the, uh, the US now. So we're going to see a lot of exciting new changes in the technologies coming in the future. That's one part. The second part is the, uh, the, the growth of the, uh, the zirconia market. Um, I think the, uh, the zirconia market absolutely is going to overtake all of the, uh, the, the PFM markets in the, uh, the US as well. Um, just for Korean end, you know, five years ago, I tried to explain this uh, a, couple, uh, a little bit before that uh, five years ago, it was about 80% PFM and 20% uh, zirconia. But today, that's flipped. It's like 70% zirconia and 30% uh, PFM now. And we see the PFM market reducing a little bit more. But I, see, I, I think the PFM market would exist. It's not going to go out obsolete. Okay. It, it will exist, but it will be a very niche market. It will be the, uh, for the people who actually will uh, have money to pay, uh, pay for the, uh, the more expensive prosthetics than the, uh, the regular zirconia kind of thing. So um, I don't think the, uh, the, the PFM market is going to go away, but uh, the zirconia definitely is uh, still on the adult rise. And the technology of the, the zirconia the, is gone above and beyond, I think. Now the, uh, the zirconia is meeting the aesthetic needs just like what the other EDAX, yes. um, and some even better yeah. on some parts, yeah. right? Yeah. I saw some of the other the, the samples that are uh, coming out from the, uh, the can I say ADAX? Yeah. Um, it's, it's amazing how the other veneers look, how the other uh, translucency, and all of this, uh, the technology that you guys put into the zirconia is, is amazing. Uh -huh. So I'm very excited to uh, try this out and uh, test and see what we can do with the, uh, the ADAX. Uh -huh. yeah. 자, 마지막으로 이제 마지막 질문인데요. 클리어덴트의 앞으로의 전략과 이제 목표 꿈이 있다면 어떤 건지 마지막으로 간략하게. So, um, ultimate dream will be to create a a group of Creodent. So we're we're in the process of creating a, a Creo group. So we'll have the the, the clinical laboratory. Then we have the the milling center. We have the, the e-commerce, we have a, a Creo e-shop ah. where you could come in and buy different components uh, that we manufacture in New York. So you're dealing directly with the other manufacturer rather than the middleman. Yeah. So you get a very better pricing yes. on that level. So, and then we're uh, studying the other implant company. Mm -hmm. Then we have a clear liner company that's on the way and a couple more other businesses down on the side. But yeah, ultimately we will try to form a, a group into the other Creo. Uh, Creo. Okay. Oh,